What is going on everybody? It's Danny Boy here. And today I'm going to teach you guys how to listen to other people's voices cuz a huge thing back in the days of Call of Duty 4 used to be that you used to go into Call of Duty 4, go to find match and then go to cage match and can you read that it says 1v1 death match and that meant that it was basically a 1v1. So something that you would do back in the day is go onto a random uh, game and put the speakers on and you could talk to other people and people could hear your voice and you could hear the other person's voice and people think that that's gone with PlayStation and Xbox One well Xbox One I don't know how you do it because my Xbox One I haven't played it in ages but on the PlayStation all you gotta do is go to settings go to devices audio devices I have my turtle beaches plugged in so you guys won't hear anything but when I put it to TV or AV amplifier you guys will be able to hear the noise and let me show you for example like I'm gonna go into a private match and switch the settings so you guys could, could see the difference so give me one second so this is the thing that I think was with the update you guys could hear the bullets right now as I'm firing the M16 but uh, I think it was the new update that PlayStation did that you can actually if you go like this and this is a problem that people having no game audio so I'm gonna show you how to fix that also which is the same thing so I go to USB headset uh, and look I bet you guys cannot hear anything now right so Right now you guys cannot hear anything and I know because I just turned my speakers on to see if you could hear anything and I cannot hear anything. So I know that you guys cannot hear anything at all, definitely. So what you guys do is the same thing. If you can't hear game audio through your recording device, just go to sound and screen. No, not sound and screen, devices and audio and just put the output to TV amplifier. I will tell you that you would have to do this every time that you turn on your PlayStation or your Xbox or if the Xbox does the same thing but on PlayStation I'm 100% sure you gotta do this every single time that you turn the PlayStation on and yeah that's the little tech test that I wanna show you uh, more videos coming soon to you guys I hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys did enjoy it please remember to leave a like and I'll see you guys peace and I'm out